welcome to my cha 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 channel. So I just reviewed the French onion dip and spread. I got this at Target, the next town over. If you're new to my channel, I do unboxing and food reviews normally in the car. I also have a Patreon so you can support me on that. But right now, I just reviewed this one, okay? So you might want to check that one out. But right now, I'm reviewing the non-dairy everything seasoned cashew dip and spread made with sesame seeds, salt, onion, poppy seed, and garlic. And this is going to be like the everything bagel, like Trader Joe's has everything bagel like seasoning. I don't like that. I'm hoping I'll like this though. Yes, it's been opened. My roommate had some. It's water. The second ingredient is cashews. Cashews are expensive. And I've said it before with this one. You know, vegan products made with cashews. I think cashews is an awesome dairy replacement. Um, whether it's like in a dip form, a cheese, or a milk. Like I make my own homemade cashew milk in my Vitamix. So anyway, that's awesome to know. The first ingredient is water. That means there's going to be a lot. But knowing that the same ingredient is cashews, and cashews are expensive nut, then canola oil, sesame seeds, salt, garlic concentrate, sugar poppy seeds, Dijon mustard, there's not that much ingredients versus this one. This one had a lot more ingredients. And the second ingredient was also cashews. This one's a little bit, it's not watery, but it's more watery than that one. It's not as thick. It kind of smells like Play-Doh. And I think I'm supposed to put this on bread, but I don't have any bread. Sorry. Mm. I don't know. I'm going to get a lot. Wow. I like that. I didn't think I was going to like it. I love bagels. I like English muffin, but English muffin. I was going to say English McMuffin. English muffin. Better than a bagel, but I do like bagels. But I do not like the everything bagel seasoning from Trader Joe's. Sorry. I like all the ingredients that's in that. But together, I just don't like it. I think it's the garlic. That is just like too toasted or something. I didn't think I was going to like this. This is really good. I think this would be absolutely amazing on a bagel. Like, make sure it's toasted really, really well. Because this is... It's not... I wouldn't say it's watery, but it's watery enough that you don't want it to soggy up your bagel. Right? Mmm. There's a little bit of an after... Actually, it's not an aftertaste... The aftertaste is good. There's a little bit of an aftertaste while you're tasting it. But then it dissipates. That's interesting. The aftertaste is better. Um, wow. I do like this better than what I just reviewed, which is the French onion. I think this would be this would go so good. So good. On a bagel. I've reviewed a lot of dips though. Vegan dips. And both of these are not my favorite. But they're far from not being good. I've reviewed dips on here that are not good. So if you're a good target. And you haven't had non-dairy in a while. Or you just want a non-dairy plant based dip. I would recommend these. I would recommend this over this though. This is my opinion. Um, There's a nice garlic aftertaste too. It's, it's strong enough to be like, wow, but it's not like burning or anything. So, you know, keep in mind on that. Um, I, real, I I can't get over the aftertaste of this. Th this is still lingering in my mouth. Like, a lot of times stuff stuff tastes good, but then the aftertaste is, eh. This, as you're eating it, it's just, yeah, okay, it's pretty good. It's a little bit of a funny taste. But then after you swallow it... Mm, I gotta have some more of this. <laughs> so, um, what am I gonna give this? Would I get it again? Yeah, for sure. Would I get it again? For sure. 
Especially if I'm in the mood to put on some bagels or bread. You know what would also be good on this? I think, um, like French bread. And toasted baguette. Mmm. You know what would go good with this? I could be wrong, but toast a baguette and then put this on top of it and then toast a little bit more. I'll run it under the broil just a little tiny bit. Not a long time. And then put some vegan Parmesan. I could be wrong. Got just a little something, something. And I'm not digging as I'm eating it. And I think it might be the lemon. It is pretty tangy. I wanted to mention that, but that's what it is. I'm sorry. It takes me a while. To... It's the tanginess. It's very, very tangy. But after it dissipates, really good. So I'm giving this a solid. 8.3 out of 10 and until next time please comment like subscribe let me know what other foods you want me to try i also got this at target uh they said it was on sale and then i got it and then they're like it's not and i told the person i was like it is so i changed the price really good but salty a little too salty for me i have my blood pressure now I guess I'm getting into like a story time. My high blood, my blood, my high blood pressure is high. My blood pressure is pretty freaking high. So I gotta watch that. I really gotta watch that. Mmm, that chip tastes better with the salt. What was I gonna say? I have really good news as far as today, and I'm gonna get emotional on my, but my depression was really, really bad. For like, I want to say three days. And today, I don't know if someone's been praying for me or having positive thoughts. But like today, I don't know. I just, I felt better. And I'm not crying because I'm sad. I'm crying because I'm thankful. Because I, I've, I've said it before on this channel. Like I do with really bad depression. And today, it was just like, wow. The sun was out and I'm just like, I'm just so like, so much gratitude is pouring out of me. Because I needed that break. I really needed some good energy vibes. So if you are praying for me or have any positive thoughts my way, thank you so much. So much. And if not, then I'm still thankful. So let me know in the comments anything you want me to know. I always try my best to read the comments. And until next time, have an awesome day. All right. Bye-bye.